What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Gemini Jets fan video and today I'm coming back to you guys with another video and in today's video uh, we're going to be doing the channel update for uh, August 2020 and this will go from 2020 all the way into 2021. In 2021 we'll be doing another one uh, giving more explanation, talking more about of what's going to happen in 2021 and cover basically of this year. But before we don't with this video, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notification bell, so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. We are in the road to 170 subscribers, so I hope this could be possible by my birthday, September 10th. I have planned a massive, not massive or 10 models or something like that, no. I think it's going to be more than 10 models, I don't know. It could not be 10 models. Maybe there won't be a massive unboxing. I'm not sure because we're going to get started with this channel update right now. The reason, so starting off, uh, the reason why I said that we might not, okay. So right now, as you guys may already know, we are in the middle of the pandemic. It's about to go, it's crazy how I'm saying this, but it's about to be a year since this pandemic has started and it has just swiped through left to right good stuff bad stuff have happened along with this pandemic um i would say i have not been affected by this pandemic at all honestly this pandemic has actually helped out my channel my family me because i'm not gonna go much into detail here about like what's going on in my family whatever it's just not because so basically I would normally, as of recording right now, it is Tuesday, August 18th, right? So this time today, if it was no pandemic, I will be already in school. This would be my eighth day of school if there was no pandemic. Because I would usually start on August 10th. Uh, but my school has been delayed to August 24th. Uh, it is planned to start, right? It's planned to start physical school. So contact and teachers and stuff, but you will have to wear masks, have hand sanitizer, um, just all take all the procedures six feet apart, no lunch in the cafeteria, lunch will have to be now in the classes, which is gonna be boring. Um, but before, let me explain this because this might be a little weird. I know this might not be a long aviation, but this will be a long video, so get your uh, snacks ready for this very long video. It could be around 20 to 30 minutes, not sure, but so basically, we are just, usually before, our friends, me and my friends and all these people would or always be like sharing our phones and be like, oh here, because we get to use our phones in class as well. Uh, we get to hear music, we get to do a lot of stuff on our phones. So that's why I post sometimes when I'm in school, in 2019 I'm talking, um, post like uh, Instagram stories and stuff because I would get allowed to use my phone. But that has ultimately just changed right now. We're not allowed to touch each other's phone. We're not allowed to touch each other's at all. There should be no contact between people. Only one person is gonna be allowed in the restroom at once. So that's gonna be crazy. That's gonna be a just crazy dilemma. I'm not gonna go into much detail here, but somebody has to do an emergency. In the regular days with no pandemic, there will be fights in the restroom for using the restroom. So I thought that was crazy. So now during pandemic times, I don't know how they're gonna handle that. People in my school are pretty wild, pretty aggressive. So, what do you mean? When you bother me too much in school, boy, get ready because I'm finna scream at you. But no problem with that, let's go into this video, apart from that. So starting off in the channel where we are right now, uh, we're on August 18th as of uh, recording this video. You guys are gonna see this on August 19th. This, that's gonna be Wednesday, right? Today is, today is Tuesday. So tomorrow, you guys are gonna be seeing this tomorrow the 19th, okay. So right now starting off, uh, the pandemic has, as of right now, of course, pandemic started, right? Um, so when it started, it was, like a chaos let me tell you that in this way chaos people would be like oh my god what's gonna happen oh my god we're gonna die oh my like it was exaggerating like every human does everybody on this world is exaggerated over the level 
that's something I just for the channel update we do have a lot of things to cover as you guys already see right here so uh, so so basically as of right now where we are exactly uh, it's it's been very good um, I before like it, it's not even like four months ago I real I only had 50 45 -ish or 40 ish almost 50 and today I have 167 subscribers almost 170 it's been amazing how I've grown in more than in four months or less I've just gone up like very I've grown reasons why because literally in 2018 when I started this channel I would okay I'm gonna show you guys right here okay in my iPad so basically in 2018 2019 it was school time I was not focused at all on my YouTube thing so YouTube to me was just basically like for fun okay so YouTube was for fun nowadays is not for fun anymore now I actually take things seriously of course right and it's amazing right because I had to work hard now and do all of this stuff um, I am not doing YouTube by any shape or form of getting paid, of getting money. That's just not my intention with doing YouTube. My intention with doing YouTube is making people happy, making them like my content, my content being amazing, me entertaining people. That's basically what I want to do. And that's what I've wanted to do my whole life, basically, since I had reason of thinking. Uh, that's basically, honestly, what I, what I'm doing here on YouTube, okay? Uh, now, people might think, okay, Gemini Jets fan, you're so exaggerated, whatever. Okay. I mean, I've worked so hard through this channel that it's been very good. And I am pleased where, where, with, where, with what I have right now. I'm, ple I'm pleased how I have fans, how I have all of you that watch my videos, how you guys just watch my videos and enjoy them. It's amazing, okay? So what I want to cover is right here. Well, it doesn't show all of it because I have a lot of videos in my channel. And it's a lot. So, yeah. I mean, basically... Okay, trip reports. So, the first video I ever posted was on October 7th, 2018. And that was a uh, Swift Air 737-400 landing at um Camagüey, Cuba. And that was the first video. 6 months after that, I uploaded a unboxing a Apple Watch Series 4 40 millimeters aluminum case space gray GPS and LTE, which is this Apple Watch I have nowadays still. This was published on September 8, 2019. Uh, so that was basically an early gift present for me because my birthday is September 10. So they gave me this gift earlier and that's why, of course, I have my Apple Watch. Um, yeah, not getting into that. But I wasn't, too, what I'm trying to get at here is I was not very active 2018, 27, uh, 2018, 2019 times. I was not focused on it. I was thinking more of school. I was recording not the best quality videos. I didn't know how to edit. It was just a chaos, okay? It was absolutely no. And now going into the pocket about um, school, onto the topic of school. So school, when am I starting? So I, um, I of course, school like i already mentioned in the beginning of the video lately we're starting on the 24th every single person i'm pretty sure every single person like our are, are already mentioned uh from march of 2019 uh, we all were out of school already so we got out of march out of school and then it just went all to online and then on may we finished school online and we went into the summer now school for me was supposed to start the 10th it got delayed to the 24th. I don't know if it's going to get even more delayed. But I already have my plans of which class I'm having and all of that. I'm going to have eight periods. That's ridiculous. I don't like 
going to periods. They're one hour, 30 minutes long. So pray for me, okay? So they're, they're very long. And, uh, okay, so basically now that school was gone for a very long time, I had more time to film more videos, get more creative in the channel, edit better, record better, upgrade some equipment. Um, and all of that equipment is going to be a thing that I'm going to talk about a little bit more forward into the video, more towards the end, more towards like the end of it, basically. So, yeah, that's that. Um, how my how the pandemic has affected school of course it has not just affected me not just two three people it has affected basically i can't speak as of out of the united states i can speak inside of the united states where i'm currently living i can say that every single student college high school middle school elementary school has been affected by this by this pandemic um yeah this pandemic has affected schools kids uh education um it is, it's affected a lot right um but for the people who have youtube it was a better thing why because we get now more time to produce film edit and for people who do youtube the people who might just look at my videos and say this dude takes 10 minutes to just add the little subscribe thingies and doom, that's it. That's not really what's behind editing. Editing takes around, it takes me anywhere from two to three hours and I'm pretty sure anybody on YouTube that edits their videos correctly, films correctly and does everything how they're supposed to be done can of course relate to this. Anybody, if you edit your videos, leave down below a comment and say if I'm wrong on this because I am, I know I'm not wrong. I know I'm 100% correct because everybody in this YouTube community who edits their videos correctly, records correctly, and does all that stuff, it should take them anywhere from two to three hours to edit a video. A video is not just watch it one time, add this little thingies. No. You have to watch your videos to edit properly. I watch mine from four to five times over, 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 and over again. I make sure every single detail is added into one of my videos. Thumbnails take another one hour to do 50 to one 50 minutes to one hour to do uh to add all the detail all of the for the thumbnail to make the thumbnail eye catching to make the videos eye catching it takes a very long time and i'm sure a lot of people can relate to that uh and that's how i've um improved myself working very hard of course watching videos on youtube on how to edit and all of this stuff which we're going to talk about how i edit and all this stuff a little bit more into the video Next time, what will the channel have for um what will the what will the channel have had time for being at home? Well, basically working hard. So the channel has grown a lot. Channel has gotten new things in it. I've been able to work, of course. Besides from editing, I have worked cutting the grass, right? Um basically the first two or three months for for two months, right? one yeah the first two months of summer i was not in my like i was still in my state but not in my like right like not where i am not like my county i was in another county right with my grandparents and i was helping them cut the grass clean the house just all of that stuff which they can barely not do because they're of course grandparents a little bit older um but i was helping them out and from that is how i got money okay from there, I started getting money and getting insides and getting those money, right? And earning my money. Then when I started earning my money, I started buying new models, started working hard to buy new models, upgrading the channel, and it's gone very, very good. Why was I off 2018 and 2019? Basically, the main reason for me being completely, completely out of YouTube in 2018, 2019 like I lightly touched over was school. School killed me in 2018, 2019. We had a lot of homework. Uh, we had a lot of work to do. We had a lot of responsibilities in my house, like taking the trash out, 
doing my homework was one of the main things because I am not trying to brag here, but I am a very, very, very intellectual student. I like to have everything perfect, everything correct. I just, I like to be the perfect person who does everything right. So um, that's a little picky of me, but what else can I do? I just love being produ productive and working hard. And another thing was because I, or I really, I didn't have the energy as well, to be honest with y'all. I didn't have energy. Coming back from school, doing your homework, working hard, doing your chores, it's just taking a lot of energy, right? And then after I'll finish all of those, the lighting will be down, so it will be a very not good lighting. I'll have to do my chores, and after my chores, I was so tired because it's not just cleaning and doing this. No, you have to take the trash out. You have to go this, you do that. It's a lot of things you have to do. So after you finish the chores, after you're done, you just go take a shower, you eat dinner, and you go to sleep because it's just, it's just you don't get time to do anything. So, yeah. Um, my goal as of right now to going forward with the channel, I do not plan on ending this channel for I will try to keep this channel forever, honestly, until I die. Um, I'm going to try to keep this channel because it's honestly an honor to have all of you here and to entertain you guys. Uh, so my goal is to be active, work harder, make interesting videos, make everybody, make new people uh, go, come to my channel, um, get the plaque, of course, for the channel. That's another goal I have um do better videos be more productive work harder like i already mentioned uh about premieres all right so if you guys have been sticking around for the past week you've been noticing all my videos have been premiered uh the, my first premiere was started was started with my tpa update which was one week ago around one week ago i don't exactly remember but that was my first premiere that i that ever started right and from there on, all my videos get premiered. And uh, they're getting premiered. Every single premiere is at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, so let's say, okay, and I, I uh, premiere every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So what I do with my premiere, some of you commenting on my videos and saying, Gemini Jets fam, you changed the date. No. Because some of you think that right when I put it up is the day it's going to get premiered. It's not. I put up the event one day before just so everybody gets a chance to turn on their reminder and, of course, get notified when the video goes live. And everybody can get a chance to go in the chat and I can chat with them. Um, and about the subroot, I before didn't wasn't really into the subroot type of deal thing. But now I have subroots. They are left down below every single of my videos. Every single of my videos will have the subroots linked down below with the airports and, um, and airplanes I have. And you get to check them out down below. And you're able to tell me what you want, uh, what route you want. Just the routes. You can read them in the comments and leave them down below. And I will be sure to make it. Of course, the, the requirements will be down below. Basically, it has to be realistic. You have to have the plane um yeah has to be realistic if you want to do a fictional route the only exception to do a fictional route is to dix brown international airport which is my fictional airport and i have to have the plane and you have to have the plane so basically let's use an example right here one of you wants to do a sub route on the american 737 800 one world right so you have the model and you want him to take the route to dix brown of course, you have to have this model in your hands, of course, and I have it. So if, since I have it and you have it, then we can do the route. But if I have one world, right, and you don't have one world, it can't be the route. You can, you're going to have to choose another aircraft, like I previously mentioned. But yeah, so that's what that is. Um, yeah. I have very, very, very big projects. I'm talking about huge, immense, very big projects coming soon. Uh, of course, you guys already know my, my about my Lubbock project, Lubbock, Texas airport. That airport is done already. It's right there, like right next to me, right there. I'm just not going to show it off right now. That airport is coming on September. It should, 
I do have to check right now. Give me a second in the calendar. Let's look at the calendar for September. Okay, where's September? September 2020, okay, right here. Oh my God, guys, this is sad, okay? Because September right here, right? On September 1st, we're gonna have an, uh, nope, never mind. Um, uh, never mind, I'm sorry. But I had planned to upload Lubbock on September 10th, which is my birthday. My birthday is September 10th, right? And I plan to have Lubbock uploaded by then, but I just found out it's a Thursday. And then my birthday is September 10th, but Red Rivers Aviation's airport is September 11th. So it's going to be lucky. Uh, well, not the day is not the best because of what happened in September 11th. I'm not going to go into that. But it's going to be his birthday and it's going to be a Friday. So that's going to be a upload. So that's very convenient for him. So next year for my birthday, uh, I will have something special. I can't. Well, this year we're also going to have something special. But next year it's going to be more and more special because it's going to be uploaded on the exact day of my birthday, which is going to be a Friday. And then it's going to be a Saturday. So it just goes like that. Okay. And then uh, other topic. <laughs> Uh, I, okay, I said it was finished, right? It's finished. Gates and all that's down and terminals and all. I still got to do finish a little bit of the terminals and add the windows. But I do still need to uh, add the grass to it to make it um, very realistic, right? Because without grass, it wouldn't be the most realistic airport that we could say. So, and then next up is um yeah the concourse is done so for flint and you guys already saw the update the update was uh premiered yesterday monday um and i'm recording this on a tuesday but you guys are premiering this is getting premiered on a wednesday so yesterday monday uh flint happened everybody was so pumped for that airport and i'm glad you guys were but yeah flint is going perfect i don't have no plans to cancel it i have plans to keep it so yeah those are my plans with Flint. Keep up the thing with Flint. Okay, next up, we have um, airports gone in the channel and will they come back? I don't, I can't exactly recall all of them, but all the airports that are gone in the channel is Tulsa, Pensacola, Albuquerque, um, Charleston, um, Oklahoma City, Laredo. I'm pretty sure those are the six airports, but all of those are gone. And the answer to will they come back is no. They will not be coming back. They're in the graveyard. They're dead already. They're not coming back to the channel. I don't have plans to bring any of them back. So that's that. And the question is, a lot of you have been asking, Yemen just fam, can you live stream? Yemen just fam, can you live stream? The answer to that is no, sorry, I can't. Uh, why? Because I've canceled all the live streams on my channel. For right now, they're going to be gone. Uh, because I'm using uh, Infinite Flight. And that's not the best flight simulator that we can. So I'm trying to get the new MSF 2020 that just got released. Let's see how that happens. Hopefully, we can get that for my birthday. And then we'll start streaming again. I'm not sure how that will go. But we'll try. Promise you guys, we'll try. But if not, live streams are going to be canceled. For a very long time it's been canceled for the past month already and i do plan to keep them that way for a couple of times massive unboxing for my birthday and what models to expect so um massive unboxing for my birthday like i talked briefed in the beginning it's not 100 percent going to pro it probably will happen probably won't i don't know i might get five six models i don't know i might get money to buy models i really don't know to this point uh, I was talking about the pandemic with that because the reason is people right now are not working due to the what the pandemic has caused and when since it's the pandemic has caused a very large problem not everybody has the money to really gift somebody or anything so I don't know if, uh, about the gifts what's gonna happen um, right now as of myself I already wasted all of my money 
uh, the money I do have left over is for my treats, like not like not, not food, but like for things I want to buy. Like if I want to buy, um, I don't know, maybe a camera. I really don't know. I, that's why I have that money left. That money is not gonna be wasted on models because I of course need things for my life. I understand about models, but my life is another thing. So I need to have money to support myself with equipment and whatever I want to buy. So that's that. Um, which uh, models are already up, right? So I've unboxed a lot of models. I unboxed the Legion MD80, the Omni Air 757, um, and the America West A319, Pinamo A319, American 752, Lloyd 738, TWA 763, McDonald's, um, MD80. Okay, but I do have some models here in the shelf that you have seen but that have not been uploaded to the channel and unboxing them. Since one of them has only been debuted in one of my videos and I, that video I don't think anybody of the new people have seen. That model will have an unboxing, but I don't know by when. We have to make a plan. So let's see by when, but I will be grabbing the models from my shelf that have not gotten an unboxing before and I'll be unboxing those. 26 minutes, that's very long. Plus the intro, that's gonna make it 27 minutes. Oof, this is going to be a long video like I mentioned. Okay. Uh, exciting ideas. So exci I have very exciting ideas to come to the channel. Like very pump videos that you guys are going to enjoy hopefully. Uh, so that's what I have for that. Um, I have very cool ideas with my collection and all that stuff. Uh, like making, growing my collection. I Okay. Let me just show you guys because you guys deserve to see this, right? So I got these things from Ikea, which is you put them on the wall like that, like like that, and you put models up here. So that's what I have planned. So that's what I'm going to do with the models. That's what I'm basically talking about right here. Of course, putting the models on a shelf in my, um, my, my wall. Uh, so we're almost like to 200 subscribers like already mentioned and if you really really want to give me a gift for my birthday But you don't have a way to the only way you can do it is by subscribing to the channel That would be very the big, biggest surprise from you guys to me on my birthday would be if we reach 200 subscribers that will be The best thing ever in this world and I will appreciate it a lot and next one down is Soon is going to be our two-year anniversary, like I mentioned, in October 7th, I think. I don't know. In October 7th is going to be our second year or two-year anniversary on YouTube, and it's going to be amazing, and I know it's going to rock, and I know we're going to make it there. So let's go. Hopefully, our channel is going to stay alive for the two years and more. So let's do it. Um, now we're going to the last topic of this equipment, okay? And then we're going to wrap up the video. So for equipment, I use the editor I used before. I used to use InShot and Filmora Go mixed together. Now I decided to upgrade myself and I'm using iMovie, which is the Apple only thing that only works for Mac OS, uh, iPads and iPhones. So yeah, it does not work for Apple Watch. So don't try if you have an Apple Watch, it won't work. But yeah, um, the cutscenes that I have been on my channel, I will continue to have them. Uh, I don't plan to cut them at all for the airport updates because it will be more interesting. It's just like jumping from one plane to the other. It's going to be easier than just moving the camera around. That's just a process that's going to get people out of the 29 minutes. Okay, That's people going to get out of the, like, not really wanting to see the whole video. Um, if you don't make, if you make it just moving the camera. But if you do a uh, sh uh, shot cut motion... It's gonna be very and enjoying. I uh, enjoy, yeah. Um, uh, I do plan, like I talk about with my money I have for the treats that I want to do for myself. I maybe, maybe, like I mentioned, maybe, maybe probably be getting a camera and a tripod. I'm not sure, but we're gonna try to work very hard towards that so we can get better quality videos. Uh, the phone I currently record with is not a camera. It's an iPhone XR 64 gigabytes red color. 
that is the one that I record with and the ones that I edit with and all of that stuff and it's amazing. Um, but then I for to do premieres I transfer from my phone to the computer, computer, YouTube. So that's how I do my premieres. Um, and I have an iPad 2019, which is this one right here. Um, uh, where's the other one? I have an Apple Watch series for, like I mentioned in the videos up on my channel. It is the waterproof version, the ceramic, and, um, it has cellular GPS, and, yeah. I also have a MacBook Pro 2020, which I showed in one of my live streams, uh, which is in the other room where I edit and stuff, so, yeah. And uh, the other computer I have is an HP 2019, and it's the red version, limited edition HP. This I use for photo editing and stuff, but I more use the um, uh, the, iMac the MacBook. I have not yet learned very good to edit on iMovie on the MacBook. Um, so that's for right now, I'm doing it on my phone, but soon, hopefully, I learn how to do it on my MacBook and then just transfer everything over there. But with that, we've covered the channel update for 2020. Um, I knew I said I was going to talk about 2021, but it's getting very long, 31 minutes. I don't want to make this in or longer because I know probably some of you are not even going to watch this for so long. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, turn on post notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video uh, and see more of me. Of course, uh, expect all these plans coming they're going to be amazing. The channel's going to pop. Lubbock's coming soon. So be prepared. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.